Ten-year-old Kessia loved summer in her native village of Tokiak, Alaska in the United States. There was no school and she could play all day outdoors. How she loved to play with her friends. They played tag and hide and seek and climbed on things. But then Josephine came over with an invitation. Josephine was a kind young woman whom all the kids, including Kessia, loved dearly. Josephine asked, would you like to go to Bible Boot Camp? Kessia had never heard of Bible Boot Camp and she asked what it was. Josephine said it was another name for Vacation Bible School and it was a lot of fun. Kessia didn't want to disappoint Josephine, but she didn't want to go. It was summer and she wanted to stay outdoors to play tag and hide and seek and to climb on things. So she didn't go to Bible Boot Camp when it started. However, her older brother and sister went and they loved it. Kessia decided to give Bible Boot Camp a chance. She learned a lot about God. She learned that he rested on the seventh day of creation and that he asks people also to rest on the Sabbath. She was glad to know more about him. After Bible Boot Camp ended, Josephine invited Kessia to go to church on Sabbath. Kessia didn't want to disappoint Josephine, but she didn't want to go. It was still summer and she wanted to stay outside to play tag and hide and seek and to climb on things. But then Josephine told Kessia's mother about going to church on Sabbath. Her mother said to Kessia, I think it's a good idea. I want to go to church on Sabbath. Kessia's older brother and sister also invited her to go with them to church on Sabbath. They had started going after Bible boot camp. To Kessia, it seemed like everyone wanted her to go to church on Sabbath, so she went. At church, she learned more about God, and she was happy to know God better. The next summer, when Kessia was 11, Josephine told her about a summer camp where kids enjoyed yummy food, made new friends, and learned more about God. Would you like to go? Josephine asked. Kessia didn't have to be asked twice. It was summer, and at camp, she could play tag and hide and seek and climb on things. She also wanted to know more about God. Kessia loved Camp Polaris. She enjoyed the yummy food and making new friends. She was happy to see that Josephine was a camp leader. And best of all, she got to know more about God as she sang songs and listened to morning and evening worship talks. Before she knew it, the week was over and the kids were packing up to go home. Kessia felt sad to say goodbye to her new friends. But then a friend spoke about coming back to camp the next year. Kessia thought, next year? I didn't know there was a next year. The next summer she returned to camp and she kept on coming back every year after that. When she was 16, she became more than a camper. She became a counselor in training helping leaders work with the kids. Cassia said it was hard to learn to act like a grown-up leader at camp. I am used to being a kid, she said. I am trying to be a leader. Part of a previous 13th Sabbath offering helped improve Camp Polaris with new cabins, toilets, and showers. Cassia and the children at Camp Polaris are grateful to everyone who gave to that offering. Thank you for your support of Mission.